Hey everybody, welcome to Rat Pack Weekend. We are, we're at the world famous Slap Factory. How's everybody doing tonight? <laughs> Come on Chicago, how's everybody doing tonight? <laughs> well, I'm your MC for the night, Joe Gold. <laughs> I think it would have been great to grow up in the Rat Pack era. I mean, come on. Frank Sinatra. Yeah. Dean Martin. Yeah. Sammy Davis Jr. Yeah. All class acts and great performers. We have Miley Cyrus. <laughs> Did anyone watch her performance at the VMAs? Yeah, she came out of a bear, um, wearing a ridiculous outfit and dancing like a fool. You know, folks, it's performances like these that are destroying the minds of the youth of our nation. <laughs> I know what I'm talking about. I've watched it 10 times now. <laughs> so, are there any birthdays in the audience? Birthday, birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday. Um, well, I just had a birthday. Uh, I just turned 12. <laughs> Thank you. And you know, being 12 is hard. You're too young for some things, too old for others, and you have to start wearing deodorant. Basically, you're stuck in the middle and you stink. Kind of like Gary, Indiana. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, I thought that since I was an only child, I didn't have to worry about hand-me-downs from older siblings. Unfortunately, I have to worry about hand-me-downs from my dad. Nothing impresses an eighth grade girl more than a kid in a plaid flannel shirt, five sizes too big, and wearing a Hooters hat. <laughs> Did I say eighth grade? I meant seventh grade. I meant to older woman. Hi. <laughs> and also, being 12, there's a lot of peer pressure in my school. Lo lots of peer pressure. So anyway, this kid the other day tried to pressure me into smoking cigarettes. He said, hey man, want to have a cigarette? All the cool people are doing it. And I thought, the only person I know who smokes is my grandma. <laughs> I didn't realize she was cool. So I said to him, hey man, why don't you wear adult diapers all day and play bingo? <laughs> all the cool people are doing it. <laughs> Also being 12, there's even pressure with my friends to decide if I'm a Cub or a Sox fan. Half my friends are Cub, the other are Sox fans. I mean, I like going to Cubs games, better than Sox games, right? 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 No, 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 no. Not because I like watching them play, because I like eating hot dogs and watching grown men cry. <laughs> My mom tries to be cool by singing the hit songs on the radio. You know that song by Katy Perry called California Girls? It goes, California girls are unforgettable. Daisy Duke's bikinis on top. <laughs> but when my mom sings it, she goes, California girls are unforgettable. Your dad is a big stupid jerk. <laughs> Did I mention my parents are divorced? <laughs> Since my parents are divorced, kids ask me which parent I love more. Truthfully, I love them both equally. I wouldn't tell them that though. I would tell them, but that iPhone 5S isn't gonna by itself, people. <laughs> Thank you and keep laughing. I'm 
not going anywhere. I'm your MC. I just wanted to hear your applause. <laughs> so, Frank Sinatra loved this town. And no one pays better tribute to his songs than a guy you can see at Ditka's restaurant five nights a week. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Johnny Vincent. in the audience? <laughs> well, um, I guess we couldn't get the original Rat Pack here, but we got a guy that has a combined weight of all three. <laughs> <laughs> well, for my next performer, you guys are in for a treat. I would love to announce him, but I think this video will do it better. Thank you. Come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. Tom Dreesen was born in a manger in Harvey, Illinois. 